I'm asking, <clears throat> I'm asking with a particular viewer in mind. Let's say that there's a young man or young woman in the position of a Tom Sowell. This is a, we're, if somebody's viewing this who loves to get online and read the early edition of the newspapers the way you did. <laughs> And they want to go to college, and they may even dream of grad school, and they love books, and they love ideas, but they don't want to become an intellectual of the kind that you describe in intellectuals in society. So I've been thinking, what, are the, what is the advice that you would give them? And I think one would be, insist on empiricism. Is that right? always insist on testing theories against the facts. Oh, absolutely. But in terms of education, you have to be very careful in which uh, college you choose. And you can't go according to big names. You go according to uh, matching what you want with what the college offers. And especially, you don't want to go to a college where the professors think that uh, uh, the students are there to provide them with an audience for indoctrination. Mm. And there's one final, we're talking here about analysis and ideas and testing ideas against reality, and I can't resist the feeling that there's an implicit theme here. You're pretty good at writing what you want to say, but I also sense a kind of implicit theme here, which is a question of character, almost a moral theme, of if what animates the intellectuals is as fundamental is simple, vulgar human pride, mm. then kids ought to pay a lot of attention to intellectual humility. Is that so? Is that a, a virtue that can be cultivated? I, I, I don't know if it can be cultivated, but uh, it's, it's hard to find for one thing. Uh, but, I, but I think that uh, they shouldn't go someplace where there is a party line and, and where anyone who says anything different is just slapped down. And that's unfortunately the case in too many universities. Mm. So you're looking for genuine freedom of discussion. Yes. And you're looking for a willingness to test theories against the Absolutely. facts. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right.